Welcome back to Texas Top Homes, where home buying, selling, and financing are all simplified. And let's talk about multi-offer situations. When you're negotiating in this kind of market, how do you help the buyer's offer get accepted? Well, most of the time, when you, if they really love the property, you know, oh, we love it, we love it, then we ask, we let them know. First of all, when we go in, we realize this is a multiple offer, because half the time when you go look at the property, there's like six or seven uh, agents deep with their clients waiting to get in the door sure. inside the house already. Yes. There, there are, or and if you if if, 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 you, if they're really serious, you can't even get in because they've locked the door for you not to get in. <laughs> but what, so then what you tell like this is a multiple offer, and they say I love the house. Then so as a result of it, we tell them, listen, if you want this house, you, I mean, and it's a, and it's and, and we know it's going to be a multiple offer. You more than likely have to go anywhere from three to five thousand dollars, in some cases even more above the right. list price in order for you to get it even for them to even think about you. Uh, also, I look <clears throat> at who their pre-approval is from, who sure. their pre-qual from, yep. and that means a lot to me. Mm-hmm. And if it's somebody like, I'm, and I don't, I'm not going to name names, but if it's somebody that I know just spits them out, unlike you guys, right. I, I don't even consider them. Mm-hmm. Well, and you know, it's funny you say that because we, we actually coach our buyers too, right? Mm-hmm. When we do the pre-approval with mm-hmm. them. We, we tell them, hey, listen, you got to expect to look at a lot of houses. Right, right. Um, try not to fall in love with any one house, right? Uh, you got you, you to buy that house and turn it into mm-hmm. your home. But if you do, be prepared to pay a premium because there's going to be 15, 20 other people out there mm-hmm. that fall in love with that house as well. Right. 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 right? Mm-hmm. And, and so you, you got to have your ducks around. One of the things that we do is we actually will call the listing agents and tell them how strong of a buar we are mm-hmm. uh, and how fast oh, we can close yeah. uh, for them. Because I think, you know, closing on time. Um, it makes a big difference. Mm-hmm. Well, the great the, uh, the great thing about most lenders is that they don't have a, a lot of our first time home buyers. They only have just enough money for the down payment and not a lot for the closing costs. Yep. And most lenders do not offer anything mm-hmm. to help them out, with the exception of if you if you. Uh, uh, Scotland pre- does. Pre- <laughs> I know. I know. Well, I know. That's why we call Nancy the queen of closing costs because. Right. She- she gives everybody five yeah, grand exactly. almost. I, I exactly. try to. I certainly try. Hey, Bernard, um, if folks want to go to your website, um, h- how do they find you? Look you up online. All they have to do is do. All they have to do is go www.yourdallasrealestate.com. That's it. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Right. And uh, do you guys give your cell phone number out on the air? Two one four. Five six two five five three six, and I answer my phone twenty four seven.